The Nature and Science Museum is an absolutely delight for both children and adults. The interruptive uh, exhibition are not only fun but also incredible educative, sparkling curiosity and encourage learning. The museum does an excellent job of explaining complaints of science in a way that encouraging and is easy to understand. The Nature History Exhibition offer a fantastic look at the biodiversity of our planet. Why the hand on science exhibition make learning a truly interactive experience. This is a place you want to visit with your children and adult that they have a fun, a lot of fun place that you want to see. That was enjoyable and educational visit, particularly for children. It provides a wealth of knowledge about history, culture, and space, etc., and a lot of a lot of it, and so many more. And there were at engaging activities throughout the visit, and they have different kind of food. You have option to choose what you want to eat there. And the children play area surrendered by nature added to be the pleasant atmosphere. And the venue is well connected across all floor and is clean and neat. You will see different kind of planets. You will learn a lot of stuff. So it's a place you want to visit with you and your children and I would like to revisit the place and yet this place is a pretty cool <laughs> I love it and my children love it especially the crystal room where they have different kind of would I say crystal or gold or silver they have different kind of places and oldest animal you can see the skeleton they have the Oldest animal, the longest animal, and when I went there, I just opened my mouth. Wow, wow, <laughs> this is really fantastic. Hey everyone, how are you doing? How is everything? I hope you are okay. You are welcome to my channel. If you are new, I'm Anita. Thank you for stopping by and thank you for clicking on this video. So today's video is all about vlog. We are going to visit the Parrot Museum of Nature and Science. It's a nature, history and science museum in Dallas, Texas, in a Victoria Park. The museum was named in the honor of uh, Margaret, Margot, and uh, Rose Pira. Welcome to Children's Museum or Respiro Museum of Nature of Science, a place where you want to have fun with adults and children. A place where you want to you want to relax your brain if you are stressed out from us work um work in self or you are stressed off in or you are depressed no is a place you want to visit to relax your brain to see a lot of beautiful stuff a lot of science a lot of um culture a lot of a uh, planet um a lot of activity you want to enjoy with your children they have a lot of stuff for children and adults and it's very educative very very educative you're going to learn a lot of stuff and they have a lot of activity to engage the children it's a place you want to visit to release stress 
let me tell you a little of my experience what i observed there and what i love about it this museum is a wonderful museum so interactive is a display uh, there is a the display are top noted there are bottom levels information video gift shop food optional modern transport and so on etc and there are places where you can also purchase your ticket where you get there uh, you can see you will see security you will see a lot of map because the place is really big you know you can get lost they will give you map so that you can you will not get lost you buy your purchase your ticket they will ask you do you want to watch movies or you just want to uh, uh, moving night they have moving night there or you just want to like see the science or the nature of it then you can see people standing there then you buy your ticket yeah where you can buy your ticket and you can use the elevator if you want to they they have a um, first floor second floor third floor uh fourth uh, fourth floor and fifth fifth floor yeah it's really <laughs> is 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 really big i uh, going to the place just as uh, going to play know that it's not a place you will just go and come at you're going to spend like two to three hours if time not taking four hours yes because it's it's very big um you can get lost if you are with your children you have to hold them with your hand if not they can also get lost because there's a a lot of activity that is going to draw their attentions and i so much enjoy every activity and there is one thing too that i love about this museum you can call it children museum or the nature the nature and science museum it's so neat it's very neat all the cleaner there they are always 24 hours trying to make sure the place is clean and you can see a lot of stuff if you lost your way you can see security you want to ask question and you see any place it was like okay i missed my way or i don't know where to go the you need help there is someone out there to help you and to answer any question you have and if you have somebody question and the person can answer it it will tell you can you please wait a little bit let me get someone to answer the question for you yes they are going to answer the question and the people there too you know they try their best to maintain the cleanliness and it's very educative um let me tell you more about the nature and science museum is absolutely delight for both children and adults and is interactive interactive um, exhibition and not only it's not only fun but it's also uh, incredible educated you know is a place where uh, children will be like curious you know they want to know what is this what they are very curious about a particular things and the place is encouraging encourage someone to learn and the museum does an excellent job on explaining about the complex of science in a way that it engage you and it is and it is easy to understand it's a natural science uh, history exhibition and it's a fantastic look it has a, let me use it has a fantastic look and uh, they have a lot about our planet thank you once again for watching uh, anita tv thank you for watching this video there's a lot of stuff you need to see the longest animal on earth and all the planet how it looks like how it operates and so on and so forth a lot of fun thing that you don't want to miss about you don't want to miss it you want to <coughs> watch it and to tell you the fact where you see some of the stuff you're gonna be amazed it was like oh my god does these things really exist uh, exit on earth yes they does even me when i see the longest animal on earth and i was like oh my god this is really cute and you can see all the planet all the seven planets you're going to see them 
the ah, uh, it look like on the picture where you can see like the picture you are seeing on this video is no when you see it real life is so beautiful really beautiful that you don't want to live there it was like your imagination <laughs> i was like oh my god is this real you know going to be curious about everything you see on this museum and they are so fun and enjoyable so watch to the end to see the heart come of it and to see the beautiful of this uh, children museum and if you have not subscribed to my channel i don't know what you are waiting for before you do that please click the body subscribe and turn on the notification bell that anytime i upload you will be the first to get the notification okay guys let me leave you not let me leave you to watch so that i won't